casual, organized chaos. A life of design and art and all of that, it's just a way of being. You know, it's not like collecting stuff to have stuff. This is like an inside joke. It's hiding a uh, light plug. I'm Tom Bianchi, and I'm an artist, photographer, a writer. Where is that book? These are the Polaroids that I took at Fire Island in the uh, 70s and 80s. I've been celebrating the beauty of the gay community since I started those photographs. As not being ashamed to be naked, not being ashamed to be in love, not being ashamed to be flamboyant. We became our own sexual fantasies. A well-designed room should look like you could just walk in it and be naked anywhere. <laughs> it's hot outside. You know, it's like people who go to McDonald's and they don't know that there is such a thing as a really exquisite hamburger. <laughs> that was me at 22 or 23. If you're living with art, it helps to move it about and because you, you, you stop seeing things after a while if they're always the same. So I guess that's like a woman dressing, you know? <laughs> Add this pin to that dress, it's a new dress. This is the man cave. I like the idea of being able to be in this cave. And I can tell when Ben wakes up from a nap, if he's in there napping. Remains of Ben at the moment. <laughs> I see his bathing suit is here, which means he may have snuck out. He is that shy. The dining table was like this. That painting was on that wall. And I looked across and thought, oh my God, Wallace is the most gorgeous man I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> and that painting was behind him and I thought, and I have to have that. <laughs> this was the shoot and I brought my friend Walter along with it. And uh, at the end of the shoot, I asked him if they would take a picture of Walter and, and me. This one's called Erotic Triggers. So my argument is, play with your sexual fantasies and reverse anything that could be destructive into something positive. Find your inner woman. Or you're not really a man. Huh, Molly? Do you want to be in the picture? Molly is a perfect expression of my philosophy of life. What really makes a good bed is when my husband and our dog. <laughs> Love remains. I took your ashes to the edge of a cliff and tossed them to the wind. I hadn't counted on the updraft. You shocked me as you covered my body and filled my mouth one last time forever. Yeah, I don't know where he went. He's, he's made sure he got his wish. <laughs> first thing I do when I come home is make sure that none of the plants have died. <laughs> That's the first thing. Uh, and the second thing is, is just take all my clothes off. <laughs> <laughs>